Meanwhile, the government is offering an explanation for why it's going ahead with the road project. Chairman of the Jamaica Labour Party, Robert Montague, was speaking at an Area 4 council meeting in St. James yesterday. He's calling for his boss, Andrew Holness, to embark on more projects in southeast St. Mary, despite the criticisms, while encouraging party supporters to go out and vote when the by-election date is announced. TVJ's Janela Pursuce reports. Election alert. Both political parties appear to have ramped up their campaign machinery over the weekend. First, the PNP. Now, the Jamaica Labour Party. The party chairman, Robert Montague, suggesting that the JLP has the edge in the upcoming by-election in Southeast St. Mary, given that their candidate, Dr. Norman Dunn, is from Anata Bay in the parish. A first-time candidate, Dr. Dunn, lost the seat by five votes in 2016. The JLP not only wants to win this time around, but convincingly. Mr. Montague explained how this can be achieved. If we take this thing serious, our labor rights must find themselves up into Southeast St. Mary because it shall soon be done. We're not joking with this one. For JLP General Secretary Dr. Horace Chang, the party will win because the government has been performing. With Andrew Hodes as a party leader and the team of young people emerging in this party, I'm confident will not only win this election, but many more to come, and the Labour Party will be in government, performing to deliver the kind of services country deserve and bringing back hope to our people. As for assertions that the JLP is buying the election, following the announcement of the $625 million road development project in Junction, that road was approved with money from the Q80 fund. And the PNP sit down upon the money and make the money go back to Kuwait. And now Andrew Holness come and find the money to finally fix the Junction Road, to make St. Mary and Portland come on the map. And the bad mind PNP them and say we never fix the road. He wants the Prime Minister to go further. And Belfield Road's road will fix the Prime Minister. Don't make them call you down, my Prime Minister. Find the money and fix every road in the South East St. Mary because it's poor people will benefit when the road fix. Fix the road. And if house be built, build the house, Prime Minister. If water be get to the people of South East St. Mary, send water to them. They are taxpayers too. Fix them up, Prime Minister. Fix them up so that when now man don't become MP, Argument. Chanel Press News, TVJ News.